UAV online. If you guys are interested in being entered into my monthly giveaways of $25 Xbox, PSN, or Steam gift cards, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, turn on notifications, leave a like on the video, and comment the console and what you know gift card you want. It's the way I like to show support. Hope you guys know the video. It's in your boy ears, and I'm out. Stay OG. Yo, what's going on YouTube? I hope you guys are having a great rest of your day. We can get this video to 100 likes. I will be opening up another subscribers Halloween hack bundle. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, turn notifications on as well as leave a like. You must be subscribed to be entered and to be able to win, you know, pretty much the Halloween hack giveaway. I love giving back to you guys. And like I said, speaking of giving back, this gameplay is actually not gotten by me. It's from my boy, it's Juggernaut. His channel links are going to be at the top of the description above. Make sure you go ahead and check him out. He was kind enough to let me use his gameplay of the Model 1887 Nuke because as you guys know, I didn't open up these supply tops on my account. So this is pretty much what he is running. He actually got this with the single model, but here's a class setup with the Akimbo model, which I believe is actually a better, you know, setup for this weapon. Make sure you guys try this out. Make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe to his channel. He definitely deserves it. He puts up a lot of good content on his channel. And I feel that, you know, I'm personally going to be giving back a lot to you guys uh, more now. So every time there's going to be a new hack, I'm pretty much going to be opening up for a subscriber. So like I said, if you guys do want a chance to, you know, pretty much be a part of that, make sure you guys subscribe, turn notifications on, and also leave a comment on what DLC weapon you want to see, you know, in the game coming up in the near future. I'm pretty much going to be picking the most active subscribers. Um, so if you guys keep coming to the live streams, keep leaving likes, keep leaving comments, you guys have a great chance of winning. So yeah, hope you guys do enjoy. You guys seem to really enjoy yesterday's video, and I hope this video is enjoyable for you guys as well. So here's a Model 87 nuke. Let's get right into it. Yo, what is on YouTube? It is your boy Ears. Hope you guys are having a great rest of your day. Hope you guys are starting off your week strong. And I want to give a huge shout out to everybody that's been coming to the channel, showing the insane amount of support. Like I said in my last video, if you guys do want a chance to win a, you know, me opening up a supply drop, you know, the Halloween scream hack on your account, make sure to leave a like on the video. You do have to be subscribed to have a chance. Make sure to have notifications on because I'm pretty much picking the most active subscriber. So drop a like, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment on what DLC weapon you want to see brought back in Infinite Warfare as well as if you guys want a nuclear variant on it that'd be greatly appreciated so let's get right into today's video which is actually going to be a deatomizer strike with the new M2187 Gravedigger aka the model 1887s from MW2 that are now in Infinite Warfare this gameplay is actually not by me but my boy Juggernaut so make sure you guys go ahead and check out his channel his links are going to be down in the description below definitely deserves a shout out as you guys know, I personally did not buy the supply drops on my account day one, so I was unable to get a deatomizer strike with this weapon. But 
you know, since you guys are on point, you guys have been helping me out, I kind of want to help you guys out. So this is kind of how I want to run, I should say, like the Halloween Scream hacks on this channel. So pretty much what I'm going to be doing, since I personally have everything already unlocked within Infinite Warfare, I have people's accounts that I can get on to get a gameplay if I need to do that. I feel like for each of these weapon deatomizer strikes, unless I actually get it, you know, opening up the free bundle and I get it like within the first game, I'm going to be uploading a subscriber's gameplay to the channel because I feel like that's probably a good idea and a good way to give back to the community as well as, you know, unboxing a subscriber's um uh, you know halloween hack for free on their account i definitely think this is something i'm going to be doing because personally like i said i have everything unlocked these nuke variants mean nothing to me and honestly i'm gonna be using them for one day and never touching them again so i might as well give someone else a shout out that definitely deserves it like i said make sure to check out juggernaut's channel and the cool thing about this gameplay if you guys are noticing is it's actually not with the akimbo variant so this actually isn't like technically the quote-unquote overpowered uh, model 1887 deatomizer strike class setup i'm like i said i showed a class setup before this vid started that's actually like my ideal class setup that i would run on this shotgun variant but he honestly just ran it without akimbo which is actually pretty cool and he ended up still getting the nuke so huge shout out to him definitely a great gameplay definitely worth a sub make sure to leave a like on his videos as well as including mine so that would definitely be appreciated i know he would definitely enjoy that and i kind of want to ask you guys as far as these dlc weapons what you know weapons do you guys want to see that were part of future or past dlc that you want to have nuke variants uh, coming to infinite warfare now a lot of you guys are thinking that they're going to be bringing back like a vpr or the xeon nuke variant within infinite warfare <clears throat> excuse me now i definitely feel that a VPR nuke variant is 100% going to be coming within Infinite Warfare. If they brought a nuke on the M2187, I'm almost positive that they're going to bring a nuke on the VPR as well as the X E01 assault rifle. <clears throat> Excuse me again, I'm kind of getting a little bit sick, but like I said, hopefully, um, I don't really know how I feel about it. Like I want them to bring those weapons within Infinite Warfare. I kind of don't. And at the same time, like they would be nice to have because the, both those weapons are very good, but I feel that the game will become very, very annoying and very, very unplayable within the new future. It's already starting to happen. A lot of players are running around with the model Akimbos. Even if they don't have the nuke variant, they're just running around with them. Most likely because they're actually getting annoyed by other players running around with the nuke variants of them. It's just going to be a snowball effect. I feel within like the next two to three weeks. And honestly, that doesn't even matter because World War II is about to drop. But I feel like within the next two to three weeks, every single lobby is going to be infested with DLC weapons like the VPR, the XEON, the... Model 87 Akimbos. I just feel that the game is going to get very, very annoying, very fast. And I mean, I don't know, man. I, I sound like I sound like I'm, you know, complaining about DLC. Like I said in my previous video, I like DLC within Infinite Warfare, but I just feel that like it was pushed out too late. And now, it, like I said, they're just scrambling for content. But you know what? Whatever. You know, any DLC is better than no DLC. Like I said, I hope you guys enjoy today's video. I'm going to just let the gameplay roll out just because it is kind of like a gameplay showcase. Don't really want to be talking over the entire thing as I am a little bit sick. So like I said, hopefully you guys do enjoy today's video. Um, like I said, make sure to check out Juggernaut's channel. He definitely deserves a subscription. And like I said, hope you guys have a great rest of your day. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace.